Hello and welcome. So, hope you are doing well. In this tutorial, I am going to show how to you can use this data entry tool. So, first of all, you need to log in as an admin and password. There is our required data entry form and our required fields. And you can see some of fields are auto filled like date and submitted by. You can change it by yourself. So, if you want to change any date, then use calendar button and it will be changed. Also, the submitted by will be suggested from your local device. You can update it anytime. Here you will see summer button like add new update delete and clear. After completing your data, you need to add new button to store your data in your database. And data will be shown here. So, if you need anything uh, update or delete, then you need to click, double click here, and data will be open. Data will, uh, details data will be open. And like I want to edit anything. Comments. Then click update button to uh, update your data. And also you can use delete button to delete your data. Okay, there is another option is search. So search the criteria like there are different types of search criteria. Uh, like if you want to search by using employee ID, then employee and also the your required data for search, then click to search. Another option is date range wise search. So last assessment date. That is two option start date and end date. For example, I need to search as a first June to twenty three June. Okay, then search and required data will be show and also the data quantity. If you want to download it, then use download button and data download in your local PC there okay data will be show okay also the refresh button to refresh full form and open all records like there is two sheet uh, data entry sheet and the support sheet data entry sheet will be the your restore data and the support sheet, summer drop down and your prediction customization. So you can use it for your drop down list editing. And again, go to the launch form, use the launch form. And if you want to close this form, then need to close exit. That's all. Thank you.